a commutation hearing for Thomas Creech. The 73-year-old death row inmate and admitted murderer is now asking that his death sentence be commuted to life in prison without parole. I'm Riley Shoemaker, your South Boise neighborhood reporter, and I spent my Friday inside ISP headquarters in a viewing room listening to testimony. IDOC staff members, friends, and Creech's wife, Leanne, testified in favor of changing Creech's sentence, saying the elderly inmate has transformed since 1994. Meanwhile, the prosecution pointed to his lengthy history of violent crimes between 1974 and 1981. The death sentence stems from the 1981 murder of fellow inmate David Jensen. Creech was already convicted and serving time for other murders. While the defense acknowledges his guilt, they advocate for an alternative punishment, emphasizing Creech transformation into a man who writes poetry, plays guitar, expresses remorse, and vows to never fight again. When asked at the hearing about the exact number of people he murdered, Creech said he did not know for sure. The daughter of victim David Jensen expressing disappointment about the IDOC staff members supporting Thomas Creech, calling it a liability and a great concern for the way tax dollars are being spent. Creech's fate now hangs in the balance as the committee considers the testimony from the defense and the prosecution. We will continue to follow this case and bring you updates as they unfold. Our team has reported extensively on Creech's case, and you can find those stories on IdahoNews6.com. I'm Riley Shoemaker reporting from Idaho State Police Department for Idaho News 6.